painting um, in the ninth grade when I was 14 years old at Floyd School. <laughs> Kathy Belser was our art teacher and I started painting then. Um, my, my boyfriend broke up with me. And uh, not that you have a real boyfriend, I guess, in the ninth grade, in uh, that summer after ninth grade, and my mother bought me my first set of paints. And um, so I've been painting ever since. Majored in art at AUM. And I won some awards at school, and so that was encouraging. And um, and I just always loved it. And never wanted to do anything but color and paint, you know. So um, loved it. It's always been my favorite thing to do. And I've been painting professionally. Uh, since '93, the full time for the past three years or so. I love to do skyscapes, uh, landscapes primarily filled with the sky. Um, but I love other things too. But but my favorite is the sky. Love to paint portraits of beautiful little children in the outside and the pretty sunlight. Um, anything. I love to paint the effect of light on things. So so my subject matter varies. Um, and I just love to paint light and how it how it makes color appear and what it does to the form. I can I know I can always sell sunflowers, hydrangeas, <laughs> um, in, in Montgomery scenes. I love painting Montgomery scenes. I remember one of the um, White House of the Confederacy that gallery told me they could have sold four times. You know, <laughs> um, I've only painted it I think twice. Um, there's some um, curb market. Scenes. I like to do a lot of, of our curb market downtown and um, all the vegetables and everything. And um, I think I could have sold more than one of one in particular. I did of a lot of fruits and vegetables up close, tomatoes and everything. Had a lot of requests for that one. I do like to paint that a lot because of all the texture and the variety of colors down there. I've done a lot of weddings lately, and I'm starting to get really booked up for the spring. Um, it just turns out to be a treasure that people can keep and enjoy, and it captures that event, that once-in-a-lifetime event. And um, you know, they have a work of art that newlyweds can have, or, or their parents. Sometimes it's been for their parents. So it's just a lot of fun. A little pressure, but it's a lot of fun. <laughs> I've done some um, civic events and things like that, and um, balls. I did a ball, the Colonel's ball, and. Um, done a few things for uh, the Montgomery Election Center. And so I was kind of used to painting people from life a little bit, not so much like a landscape, but um, so anyway, I, I just took the challenge and it's been fun and I seem to learn something every, every time I do one. I had an art instructor in college, Phil Coley, he said, you know you're successful when, you're, when your work is your play and your play is your work. And I think he's right. And I feel like my play is my work.
it, so I'm not bent against myself. If it's all right with you.